now let us discuss here about linear search using javascript using javascript uh, so first let us uh, create the uh, form so form uh, we have to use form tag element in order to perform operations on the form we use as name attribute uh, let name of the attribute is linear linear uh, next uh, uh, let us create the form so first let us have some label so enter key element enter key element next to close the header tag uh, next uh, let us create uh, uh, some text box so that uh, we have to element the uh, corresponding key in the text box we know that we can create text box with the help of the type value text name is equal to let name is key so to perform uh, operations on the text box we have to use name so let name is equal to key so close the text box so let us save the program and uh, run it run it so enter key element uh, so we have to enter the key element in the text box uh, so next uh, uh, let us uh, have one more uh, label for displaying the result so control c so result result we need to uh, display the result in the second text box so result result input type equal to text in order to display the result let us assume that name is result so control s so let us run it so that uh, uh, if, if we need to enter the key element in the text box and the corresponding output output message is should be present in the result box okay key element is found or key element is not found those messages has to be displayed here next we need to create a button uh, we know that uh, we will create button with the help of the input tag element so type is equal to button type is equal to button next value is equal to let value is uh, search 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 next on click is equal to we have on click event uh, in the on click event we need to call the function so let name of the function is linear underscore search uh, next uh, on click is equal to yeah next to close the tag element okay so control s on click is equal to linear underscore search so let us run it so that we will have button search button okay search button or uh, if you want uh, just use some paragraph tag element so that uh, the button will be displayed in the next line so we will have button in the next line uh, next let us uh, write the code in the script tag element okay let us write the code in the uh, script tag element uh, so let us have an array so where a equal to uh, let the array contains uh, five elements so 10 20 30 40 50 so let the elements of the array are uh, 10 20 30 40 50 mm, next let us define the function uh, so here uh, in the function itself only let us declare the array so function function what is the name of the function linear underscore search linear underscore search uh, next uh, uh, array values are uh, 10 20 30 40 50 60 uh, next where let us have a variable called flag the initial value of the flag is 0 so 0 specifies that key element is not found Whereas one specifies that key element is found next where key equal to so we have to retrieve the value which we entered in the first two text box so here the form name is linear whereas we need to enter the uh, corresponding key element in the first two text box so we have to write as linear dot key dot value so linear dot key dot value okay next let us use the for loop so for iteration we can use for in loop so for where i in a so we have to iterate over a so all the elements of the array will be iterated so we know the logic for the linear search so we have to compare key element with elements of the array one by one if key double equal to a of i so then what we need to do is uh, if the key element is found then initialize flag value to one so flag is equal to one specifies that key element is found if key element is found then execute break statement so that the remaining elements won't be compared okay the remaining elements won't be compared so flag is equal to one break next to close the 
if next to close the if next to close the for okay so next if flag double equal to one then we can say that key element is found we can say that key element is found so we have to display the result in linear dot so what is the name of the form linear dot and we have to display in the second text box what is the name of the second text box what is the name of the second text box result so we need to write yes linear dot result dot value is equal to so let us display the message yes key element key element found key element found next else yeah there is no need of any parenthesis here control c copy the statement else else that means if flag is zero then then linear dot linear dot key element is not found okay key element is not found so already for loop is closed now we have to close the function now we need to close the function so let us close the function now and then uh, uh, we need to close the script to tag head tag already it is over next we need to close the form here we forgot to close the form let us close the form here let us close the form here now save the program and run the program okay okay so we need to enter the key element here the elements present in the array are 10 20 30 40 50 so let me enter 30 click on the search button if you click on the search button we got message yes key element is found now let us enter 300 300 is not present in the array so we'll get message yes key element is not found so in this way we can search an element with the help of the linear search using the JavaScript.